Good afternoon. This is Universal News Media. Today is March 28, 2018. Today we will be viewing images from unedited photos obtained March 26 and 27 from the Federal Aviation Weather Cams in Alaska. All videos are in time-lapse mode with each frame equal to 10 minutes. Our first video was captured by the south-facing weather cam in Nenana, Alaska. At first, it looks like nothing is there, but some contrast brings out a highly crater-pocked planet. And as we move through the frames, it is obvious that this cratered planet is spinning through space. Some contrast applied helps to bring out its amazing texture. It's easy to see that it has a very fast rotation. Here's a close-up with contrast. The contrast works much better without the sun's glare in the picture, so I cropped that out. The southeast-facing weather cam in Red Dog, Alaska, captured what is a very frequently viewed sight. The sun appears to be changing sizes dramatically. Some viewers may recall that we saw the sun increase nearly 30 times in size on March 19th from the south-facing weather cam in Kipnook, Alaska. You must have an IQ of at least 75 to realize that this is not normal and that something is very different in our recent sky. In Wainwright, Alaska, nothing out of the ordinary appears to be happening on this south-facing camera, but some contrast applied shows an orb in the center of the screen. As we move the frames along, we see that there is another orb, very large, with some striking texture. It appears to have an enormous crevice near the top. These objects are made nearly transparent in the atmospheric chemicals. Alaska and, chem and Canada do have chemtrailing, but the chemtrailing is less than what it is in the lower 48 states. This is why these weather cams are able to see things up north that we don't see in the lower 48 states. Here is another hidden orb, full of incredible texture, viewed from the south-facing Ugonic Bay, Alaska camera. Only one frame showed this planet because of the cloud cover. It's nearly invisible until some contrast is applied to bring out its features. Here is another planet hidden in front of our eyes, caught on the southeast-facing weather cam in Toke, Alaska. Some contrast allows us to view it better. The pink spot on the orb is the jet that causes all of the oddly shaped and colorful reflections we frequently see near the bottom of these FAA images. This jet's function is explained in several previous videos. Here are these two spinning planets we often see on the northwest facing weather cam in Toke, Alaska. The chemtrailing must not be quite as heavy in this area for this type of visibility of these planets. And I'm not even going to try to guess what showed up on this south-facing camera in Nondalton, Alaska. It was only there for one frame due to the heavy fog. So I'm guessing it could even be a camera issue or a strange reflection of some equipment. If anyone has a suggestion of what this could be, please leave it in the comments for us. These are very interesting shapes that were visible on the camera for only the one frame. The celestial objects we have just viewed are part of an approaching celestial system. Many people ask when this system will make its closest pass to our Earth. A general indication of time is provided in the following screens of text. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe. 